Welcome to the Easy Tech News Channel, and uh, of course, what was in the news in 2020? Well, I think that uh, we've never, ever had a year where as many people work from home than this year. You know, working from home has been depicted in many, many times over the years and over decades. I mean, even as far as old PCs when the Commodore computers were king and all of that, we already at that time were thinking of how we would all work from home at some point and life would be easy, no more commuting, no more going to an office. And that never really, really took off. I mean, there was a small percentage of people that did work from home over years, but it was never that big of a, um, of a footprint. It always was a small percentage. It probably is the fact that we needed a pandemic to understand that, you know what, working from home might actually work. And actually, a lot of companies have confirmed that since they have employees working from home, a lot of them have noticed that the workflow is either as, as the same or even increased. Some companies are now rethinking the way of the future because they're thinking, well, you know what? This work from home thing is actually working great. A lot of people in a survey, actually, a lot of people that started working from home, 68% said that they would really like to continue like that and that they enjoyed us. And of course, uh, it is showing the power of how you know computers and the internet today are actually good enough now to really make this workflow. Of course, there's the there's a slight disadvantage, and probably the biggest comment is, yes, there are some times when uh, people would like to be in a same room with other work coworkers because there's that you know missing. Um, human interaction that is sometimes useful and, and, and good to have. But overall, I think we can call the year 2020 the year of the working from home with your computer, your devices, uh, and doing Zoom meetings over the internet. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.